This is a short video on the clinical application of the Three Treasures Remedy Prosperous Earth. A prosperous Earth is a variation of the very well known Liu Jin Zetan, the Sixth Gentleman Decoction, which uh, primarily tonifies spleen qi. It has a mild effect on resolving dampness, but that's a very mild one. The main emphasis of the prescription is to tonify spleen qi which, as you all know, is extremely common in the patients we see. It is primarily a tonic prescription. Uh, and it does not resolve dampness or phlegm, and therefore the pulse will be weak or empty. And I'll say a little bit more about this very shortly. Spleen deficiency is extremely common in the patients we see of all ages, from children to, to the elderly. And spleen qi deficiency causes a lot of digestive symptoms, uh, such as poor digestion, ab abdominal distension, loose stools, and also it often causes a lethargy after eating. And apart from the digestive symptoms, of course a major symptom of spleen qi deficiency is tiredness and especially tiredness with a strong desire to lie down. The spleen controls the muscles and its deficiency often also causes a, mus a muscle weakness, especially of the muscles of the legs. The tongue uh, indicating spleen sheet deficiency is pale or slightly pale with teeth marks. Um, I have made a slight change to the Liu Jin Zetang prescription, the Sixth Gentleman Decoction, by adding uh, two herbs which also tonify Lang Qi, such as Huang Qi and Shan Yao. So, compared to Liu Jin Zetang, Prosperous Earth tonifies Spleen Qi, but it also tonifies Lang Qi. Now, as I said earlier, Spleen Qi deficiency frequently leads to dampness or phlegm. And if dampness or phlegm are predominant, then I would not use Prosperous Earth, but I would use remedies to drain dampness and resolve phlegm. And to drain dampness, I have the remedy called Drain Fields. And to resolve phlegm, I have the remedy called Limpid Sea. So how do we know if dampness and phlegm are predominant? Apart from knowing that from the symptoms, the pulse is very important. If the pulse is primarily full and slippery, then dampness and phlegm are predominant, and I would use one of the two remedies I just mentioned, rather than using prosperous earth. So, as far as the pulse is concerned, an important sign for the use of prosperous earth is that the pulse is weak, or empty.